सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट कूल एंड न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ लोगो एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग सेब प्लगइन गाइस फ्री प्लगइन सो नाउ गाइस आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ ब्यूटीफुल लोगो एनिमेशन सो गाइस स्टॉप एंड आई क्रिएट न्यू कंपोजिशन न्यू प्रोजेक्ट एंड गाइस क्रिएट न्यू कंपोजिशन सो क्लिक एंड कंपोजिशन नेम गाइस टेक मेन लोगो एनिमेशन and duration 10 second is good so press ok yeah and right click guys import your logo guys i have logo like this and select logo and import yeah drag and drop on here yes right okay so guys now i changed logo color that's my black color logo so like fill and go to effect and preset and i use fill so select and apply on here yes so guys that's my simple logo that's my png format file right okay so next one guys right click and pre composition and guys move all attribute check click on here made one so guys added us logo so press okay yeah right okay so now guys select your logo and create auto dress this one yeah and guys see that's my simple setting right and press ok yes see guys that's my auto dress right ok so now guys double click on this logo and hide this one yeah right ok so next one guys i apply this ten sabre effect so select this logo effect and apply sabre plugin this one yeah and guys custom co so co type i use layer mask yes Okay, so guys, I change preset. Use arc vector. Yeah, that's my effects. And now, guys, I change color. Guys, I use like orange color. So like twenty four hundred and hundred. Yes, and guys, glow spread. I like zero point two five is good. Yes. See, guys, that's my really cool. Okay, so now, guys, go to on render setting, and guys, I use transparent effect so compositing setting use add yes and next one guys i create flicker effect so flicker this one and flicker guys intensity i like 300 is good and speed i like 30 yeah and guys go to on preview and play animation guys take a little bit time so i change resolution use auto so go to back and play Yes, see guys, that's my cool flicker effect. Right? Okay, so now guys, I create simple animation. So guys, I like go to 0 0.10 frame. Here, 0 0.10. And mask evolution check. And start offset check. So guys, mask evolution go to like 5 second. Here, 4 second. I go to on 4 second. Guys, mask evolution, I like 3. And start offset. Guys, take randomly like 75 is good. Enter. Yeah. So, guys, go to back and play. Yes. See, guys, that's my animation. Okay. So, guys, I change this time. Start size. I like double 200. And end size 0. And end offset. I like 0. Okay. So, guys, go to back and play. Yes. See, guys, that's my cool effect. And next one, guys. I create easy in so press U. So guys go to on here and guys select this one key mask evolution and start offset and press F9. Yes. Okay, see guys, that's my masking. So you can uncheck like this. Yeah, yes. Right. Okay, so now guys go to back and play. Yeah. See guys, that's my only one side. So next one guys, I create more. So guys duplicate this layer. Press Ctrl D. Yes. And guys go to on here. I change color, glow color. I like this time blue. Like 210. Yes. And guys next one. So press U letter. Yeah. Guys I change this keyframe. So go to on here like 1.15. 1.15 frame select this key and go to on here like this 
and next one guys i go to like five second select this key and change to five second yes and also guys i apply this time here and offset this one so guys go to on 0 0.10 frame here and and offset check okay so guys go to on lastly five second five second and and offset i like 100 yes so guys go to back and play yeah see guys that's my two colors it's really beautiful right and select and press u and next one guys select this one keys and press f9 f9 yeah okay so guys go to back and play yeah it's really cool see guys that's my first step and now guys i create zooming if animation so guys unfold this layer and right click i take this time null object so guys select this logo and connect with null like this so guys now i go to on here like two second and null object guys position check guys position check and guys i go to on like 0 0.10 second so actually guys also i create 3d so all layer should be on 3d and select p guys change this position so minus 2400 enter so guys select keys and press f9 so enter yes see guys that's my zooming effect right so guys go to on back and one more time play yes it's pretty good okay so now guys i change some setting on graph editor so i select this key and click on here graph editor guys select your graph editor and create animation like this yes really good okay so guys go to back and play yeah much better right okay so guys my logo animation is really good and next time guys i apply the next time glitch effect so guys for glitch effect select all layers and right click guys use pre-composition and pre-composition guys i use rgb color so that's my first one r and press ok yeah see guys that's my r layer and guys go to one effect and preset and this time i apply shift here shift channel this one and apply on r layer this one okay so now guys go to on here take green use full off and full off i use this one only red color that's my red r okay so now guys select your r letter and duplicate so press ctrl d and that's my g that's my green so select guys i change this one so first one off and second one green from use green so click on here see guys that's my green color so guys first one red second one that's my green and now guys i take one more so press ctrl d and that's my blue rgb so click on here use green color so made one off and lastly use blue yes right see guys that's my blue color so first one is red and guys second one it's green and third one blue okay so next one guys all is good and now guys i create glitch animation and guys go to a new and new null object so null object check and guys select your null object and i apply this time slider control so guys go to one effect and preset and type slider select this one that's my slider control guys apply on null object like this right okay so now guys see that's my effect and preset and that's my lock option so click on here that's my lock so guys select your r letter layer and press p that's my position and guys holding alt key and click on position yes okay so now guys go to one here that's my transform and apply wiggle that's my wiggle enter 
and guys press 20 comma and click on here that's my slider yes and now guys lastly holding shift key and bracket enter see guys that's my two brackets and press enter yeah that's it guys right okay so guys now i apply same effect on all layers so right click on position and copy this one copy i select and press ctrl v yeah that's it guys so i show you my all layers so select and press p see guys that's my animation and guys press double u yeah guys i apply same effect on all layers okay so now guys i create animation this one slider animation so guys go to on here like 0 0.15 frame 0 0.15 and slider check guys slider like 100 yes and now guys go like go to on randomly like 2 second and slider minus 200 enter and now guys go to on like 3 second here and slider are like 0 yes so guys go to on here okay see guys that's not correct so it's not looking so good so select all layers and right click use screen yes and guys go to back and play yeah much better see guys that's my beautiful glitch effect and go to back and play yes okay so now guys this time i apply more glitch so guys go to on like five second actually six second is good six second and slider guys select your null press u slider check and guys go to on like 6.15 like 200 enter and like go to on 7 second slider same 0 yes and guys select all keys and press f9 and go to back and play yes see guys that's really cool right okay so next one guys select all layers select this one all keys this one and holding control or and click yes so guys go to back and play yeah much better see guys that's a beautiful effect right okay so now guys this time i apply some effects so guys i also create some color correction so use adjustment clear yes and guys i apply this time glow effect select glow apply on adjustment clear guys threshold 100 radius 100 and intensity like 2 is good 2 and guys i use second one exposure select this exposure and apply on adjustment layer and exposure i like one is good yeah much brightness color right see guys and guys if you want to create more brightness you can increase exposure only like 1.5 yeah much better right okay so next one guys i apply cool effect like stretch animation guys stretch effect so guys go to on here effect and preset i apply optical flare effect optical select and optical this one and apply on adjustment clear yes so guys go to on here like two second and optical guys i like 150 and guys reserve lens check guys click on here and go to on like three second and view i like zero yes and guys you can change this one orientation i like vertical is good for me so guys go to back and play yes see guys that's most beautiful animation with using free server plugin yes really good right okay so next one guys i apply some cool effects so go to one here project and right click import and import file guys i have some particle effect so select guys you can download this particle effects from my website so go to one here select that's my smoke color and opacity change i like 50 is good and that's my particle so drag and drop simple and next one guys use add yes select this particle 
and control D and go to an up. Guys, I change this effects like this. So guys, go to back and play. Yes. See guys, that's my beautiful effect. It's really good. Right, that's my final animation guys. It's really good. So now guys, stop and use full. Guys, take little bit time for render preview. So preview and preview check. Okay, so guys, my final animation is finished. So if you like my video, please share and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.